the autumn statement was a, a pro-business uh, confidence building announcement by the Chancellor. Uh, it's good to see a budget surplus penciled in by 2018-19, albeit some way off now, uh, but after decades of deficit, we believe the Chancellor is right to look for a surplus in the long term. Why do we say that? Because we need to get the public debt to GDP ratio down in the long term, and the best way to do that is to run a surplus. Now, it's a long way to go, um, but he's signalling now that we have to stick with the austerity policy and the IOD supports that. What else does the IOD support in the budget? Well, I think the welfare cap was one clear measure that we wanted to see. We'd like it to be wider than that. Clearly, it excludes uh, public pensions, but it's also a step in the right direction. The easing of business rates and the 2% cap there, and also uh, the help on business rates to smaller retailers, all very welcome. And as well, he's trying to tackle the jobs tax, national insurance for under 21 year olds again. So those measures will help boost business confidence, business employment and business investment as well. Now, the Chancellor really didn't have a lot of money to play with. We all know that was the case. But what he has done is set a course which certainly should reinforce economic recovery in 2014-15. He didn't have a lot of money to play with. And what money he does have to play with will probably only be revealed in the budget next year. But this was a good autumn statement, good for business, good for the recovery, and probably about as good as we could hope for, really.